So my dad is the reason that I'm playing golf right now. He was the one who introduced me to the game and it's the reason that I think I found so much enjoyment from it. Someone said this is the hardest hole on the course. Yeah, I mean, I think it's, it is for my dad. For Bronte it is, because she's playing me. <laughs> he still thinks he's the better golfer, surprisingly. <laughs> but um, no, he, he's been a huge inspiration, honestly, for me throughout my whole life. When people ask me, you know, who is the person that you look up to the most, it is really him. When you have a child, you just hope that they're going to be happy and find something in life that makes them happy. And Bronte's found something in life that makes her very happy. And that also she's, uh, she's very good at, so she's in a very fortunate position. I had some years at school where I really struggled and um, golf was the thing that actually kept me going. And so that gave me confidence in myself that, well, if I can perform and do this great thing in golf, there's no reason why I can't do that in life. At times when I first started out, you thought that you needed to be there at all hours of the day, training until your hands were bleeding and it's totally self-harming. You can't be on all the time, but if you can figure out ways to peak at the right times and um, making sure that you're healthy and fit, all those things ultimately add up together to give you the best chance of performing at the highest level. I was very lucky to have such supportive parents who, um, you know, really been there for me the whole way. And so for me, Whenever I can, I will take time out to, um, you know, speak to kids and just give them an experience that hopefully will lead to something bigger. And if I can inspire them to, you know, dream big and achieve something, maybe they won't go on to play golf, but they'll remember that experience for the rest of their life. And hopefully any career that they go into, they'll also want to inspire children. There you go. Oh, I'm still on in there. We're watching the Solan Cup, was it last year? And it's just, you know, it's nice seeing her up there on the screen. <laughs> <laughs> I always dreamed of being an Olympian. I just chose a sport that at that point was not an Olympic sport. The fact that it's an Olympic sport now makes me so excited because I'm going to have my chance to fulfill that dream. Did you get that one? <laughs>